What is going on, everybody? I'm Ben, and welcome back again to the finale of The Last of Us. I am joined by Nazu here. Nazu is all amped up now, not sleeping like she was in the last episode. She's all amped up and ready to go and all peckish and all that good stuff. All right, so we got the finale. I just watched it, like, back to back. I just watched episode eight. Now I'm watching episode nine. And, man, whew, all right. Last episode. Oh, went downhill real fast. So we're just going to shut up and we're going to go right into this. And it's crazy. It's crazy that this is like the last episode. Wow. All right. All right, everyone. All the love is appreciated. I appreciate you. And let's shut up and hop right on into this. Okay. It's going to be the intro. Heavy breathing. Oh, no. What? There's no intro? Oh, damn. What are we doing right now? We're just in the woods. Who's this? Bro, is this gonna be Ellie's mom? Is this like a flashback to when Ellie was born? Oh no, yikes. Oh no, oh no, oh dear, oh dear. Is she gonna, is she gonna? Oh my God, look at this. I feel like this is, and maybe that's why she's like, oh my, Woo, yikes. The good stab, the good stab, come on. Ooh, I hate babies. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, damn. Yep, okay, yep, that's what I thought. Okay, now we got the intro, okay. I got confused. I was like, all right, we didn't have an intro. Oh dear. She's not gonna last too long now, is she? I don't want you to give her this. No, oh, it's the knife, huh? So you pick her up right now. And then you kill me. Oh Jesus. Oh, you better hurry up. How are you gonna do it though? Cause you, you should not be shooting a gun around a baby. Oh man. Cover her ears. Yeah, cover her ears. Good. <laughs> My man, you didn't even cover her ears. What the hell? There were no ears covered there. You think putting a little jacket next to her ears is covering her ears? That was, that was a little silly. Hey. Is that Boggle? Boggle? Okay, what's, oh, she's like, oh, poor girl. Hospital that way. They had a guitar in that RV. It was all smashed up, but got me thinking, maybe I should find one. I haven't played in forever. In fact, I was thinking maybe I could teach you. I bet you'd be great at it. <laughs> oh my god. You know how to play guitar? This is... Ellie. Man. Oh yeah. Oh jeez. That'd be great. God, this is rough, man. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. Cut through that building to get around that stuff, find a skyscraper, go up and look around. Found some dynamite in that RV back there. Really? No, so we're gonna cut through that building, find a skyscraper, huh. go look around. <laughs> no, it, oh my god, man. It sucks, because it's like, it seems like he's like really kind of like trying to be, you know, more like, I don't, I, don't, I don't know how to word it, but he's talking, like he's talking more. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like he knows that like, okay, like he has to be the voice now. Like he has to, he has to know. Like he has to notice this. Oh wow! Whoa. Just a lot. Oh, what are you doing? Damn it, Ellie. Up here. What the fuck, Ellie. man? What are you doing? Are you kidding me? That just like pissed me off. Like that's stressful as hell. You don't just go running, taking off. What the hell are you doing? Oh damn. <gasps> Draft. 
This reminds you of the Brachiosaurus scene in Jurassic Park. <laughs> right. I can't hurry up. Oh man. This really reminds me of that, and it's really funny. Oh my goodness, look at you. Well, where's she going? Come on, Stop! Come on, oh my god. Sometimes you gotta let them just walk away. They're walking away for a reason. They're all done. They're moving on. Don't pester them. So? Is it everything you hoped for? Got its ups and downs. You can't deny that view. That's good. There was a smile there, at least. I know you mean well. I know you want to protect me. You have. And when we're done, we'll go wherever you want. Tommy's. Sheep ranch. The moon. Hmm. I'll follow you anywhere you go. But you gotta do this. This has to be done, right? But there's no halfway with this. Yeah. We finish what we started. Yep. I, you know, I'm not gonna lie. It honestly, we're only like what ten minutes into this or something. But I feel like this is gonna be kind of mellow in comparison. Like, obviously, obviously, I'm just jumping the gun right now, but I feel like this episode is going to have some mellowness to it. Emergency medical camps. Obviously didn't last. They had me in one just like this. With Sarah? Who knows? she has gone already? Sheesh. Oh, wow. They're talking about it. Wow, look at that. <gasps> well, I've got to hand it to the Army people. They were way better at stitching you up than I was. It was me. What? I was the guy who shot and missed. Oh, that's not mellow. What? Sarah died. And I couldn't see the point anymore. Well, that. that instantly. Oh, fuck. And I wasn't scared either. I was ready. Changed your mind last second and just swiped it right up. Went to pull the trigger. I, I flinched. Yep. Hmm. Still don't know why. Wow. Anyway, the reason I'm telling you all this I is... I know why you're telling me all this. Yeah, I reckon you do. So time heals all wounds, I guess. It wasn't time that did it. I swear to God. Well, I'm glad that... that didn't work out. Just got real emotional real fast. Oh man. We should probably get going. Yeah. Bloody hell, man. Bloody hell. You know what I'm in the mood for? What? Shitty puns. Oh, oh, oh. Look at them, man. People are making apocalypse jokes like there's no tomorrow. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. I like that. That was actually good. That's a zero out of all ten. Right, all right. Oh, I love this. Five out of ten. Oh shit. Oh my god. Army? Oh god. Oh Jesus, of course. Firefly? Welcome to the Fireflies. See, Marlene? Oh, we got hit pretty hard. What the hell? Jesus, Marlene! Our doctor. He thinks that the cordyceps in Ellie has grown with her since birth. Why is she in surgery? It produces a kind of chemical messenger. It makes normal cordyceps think that she's cordyceps. It's why she's immune. He's going to remove it from her, multiply the cells in a lab, produce those chemical messengers. And then I can give it to everyone. Okay, but what's it gonna do to her? Cordyceps grows inside the brain. Oh, so they're doing a brain surgery here. We didn't tell her, we didn't cause her any fear. There no. won't be any pain. No, you take me to her, you take me to her right now! Y'all better hope you don't open that fucking infected wound up hitting him in inside. I promised her mother that I would save her child, I promised. So I do understand. Yeah, that's... I'm the only one who understands. That does put Marlene in a, uh... Kind of the same bubble there, yeah. That's, yeah. 
Mm. Yeah, yep. Right, now see. Now see. Walking onto the highway, leave him there with his pack. Give him this. Wow, really? He tries anything. Really, you're gonna fucking. You know what, Marlene? You know what? Don't know how I feel about you anymore. Think you're real cool, think you're real badass, but also, uh... Ah, of course you shed tears, and now I'm just like, well, I mean, I guess you're doing what you feel you gotta do. But your men are about to get their fucking shit rocked. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah. Into the hallway. Get him with the one-two. Turn around and catch him with a falcon punch. Oh, we're going on the stairs? Okay, yeah. Well, good luck, guys. Good luck to ye both. Gotta hit him without letting them get any shots off. I said keep walking. Well, oh. Where is she? Fuck you. Is the other man dead? Well, they're both dead. Okay. God, it's something about it when their their eyes are just wide open. It's like, well, sure, stare right into my soul. Okay, Nazu, hi, hello. How you doing there, huh? Oh yeah, he's just taking them out now. All right, I guess you're just hanging out there. Okay, that would be my eyeball bird, come on. Ooh, I was wrong. There is no mellowness to this. Bam. Oh, wow. Holy shit, what a shot. You look crazy. Oh, that's good music there. Okay. Are you still gonna shoot him? Mm, man, yeah. And at this point, you can't trust any of these people. They're gonna put their guns down, and then you're just gonna... My guy. <gasps> Oof. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. This man is brutal you gotta be though you oof my god this is insane dude and it's gonna come down to marlene and marlene's gonna end up getting a shot off on him and it's gonna be all problematic i have this really bad feeling in my gut that joel's gonna die in this episode and i'm not gonna lie to you if that happens i'm gonna be pissed okay I'm going to be angry. I'm not going to be happy about this. That is a <laughs> an adorable little elephant there. Oh God! What if they're in the middle of surgery? Like there, there's some good time passed. Yeah, see, you can't just barge in there. What if they got her fucking head open? I won't let you take her. Don't hook her. Ugh, yeah. Fast. Nurses don't try anything stupid. I don't think they would, but... Again, can't trust anyone in this goddamn building, apparently, so... Wow. This man really came at him with a scalpel. Oh, Jesus. It's not... Yep. No, it's not gonna go. Keep her safe forever. Even after what you've done, we can still find a way. You're gonna have to find a new doctor. You put a bullet in the doctor's head, like, <laughs> and you know what? <sighs> She's not wrong about the whole, like, okay, what would she decide? Because she wanted to keep going. She wanted to keep going. She wanted, she was like, you know, we have to try. We made it this far. We have to try and all this and that. I have a fucking hair right on that thing. And, uh, yeah. It's all right. You're with me. Take it slow. She's gonna be like, oh, did it work? And nothing happened. Turns out there's a whole lot more like you. People that are immune. Dozens of them. They've actually stopped. They've stopped looking for a cure. Oh my god. That's... Raiders attacked the hospital. I barely got you out of there. We'll find you some new ones on the way. 
Joel. Joel. I don't know if that's the right way to go about that. Oh, goodness. Okay? No, she's not. I'm taking this home. Oh. I mean, oh god, what if she was like... No, I was gonna say, what if she was like awake? Jesus Christmas. Really? Oh, man. Just come after her. Wow. I feel like it's like, it's the father in him, you know? He's like, he's not taking no chances, no one trying to do any harm to her. And, no, oh, it just doesn't. Oh, dearie, dearie, dearie. Wyoming. Okay. I was thinking Oregon. Oregon. Damn. You know, she got us close enough. When Sarah and I used to hike like this all the time. Look at him. Like that, he's really like he's opening up. Before it's like don't say a damn word about her, and now sitting there talking. God, I don't know what it is about this episode, but it, it feels so awkward. Something about just like it feels so awkward. What happened? When I got bit in the mall, I wasn't on my own. Oh, she's oh, she's bringing she this out. Too. Jesus. We didn't know what to do, and she says, "We can just wait it out, be all poetic, and just lose our minds together." You find something new to fight for. Yeah. Maybe that's not what Swear you want. Swear to me. What? Swear to me that everything you said about the fireflies is true. Oh, and he's mm, he's going to. I swear. Oh, you're a fuck. Oh, oh, Joel. She doesn't believe that shit. No. Okay. Oh my god, I... Really? Oh my god, you're joking! What? You serious? Is there anything after this? For one, why did that feel like it was like the shortest episode? That felt like the shortest episode. Which is pretty crazy that it was the final one and it felt like the shortest one. But also... Oh, man. I'm... I'm not too happy... It was a great episode, but Joel, my man, I am not too happy about the decisions that you are making, and I feel like they're going to come back somehow, and that's what I'm dreading, is all of this is going to be, it's going to swell up and it's going to come crashing down on you, bud. God damn it. I hate stuff. Oh my God. It, oh my God. I mean, it's a good way to end. It's a good way to end it because you got all this stuff. Now there's all this like, it's going to be trust issues. And it already seems like, like I said earlier, like this, this whole episode felt really awkward. Because I don't know if she's like, her whole demeanor changed. She's like thinking about other stuff. And then she's thinking like, Joel's talking a lot. Like he's, he was doing a lot of talking in this episode. And I mean, he was bringing up a lot of, you know, he was talking about his daughter. Which, I mean, look at that. Look at that recovery, you know? And it was just... It's like that thing where it's like you know someone's upset, so you kind of talk a lot. So it's like, you're fine. Like, you don't have to talk. Like, I'll do all the talking. And, like, that's what this episode felt like. And it was just like, oh, my God. Just, like, let there be silence, please. Just, let, <laughs> just, just, just be quiet. Oh, man. And, of course, this man goes... 
falls to the wall and just kills everybody and then lies about it in like the most intense way you can because she was like vulnerable as can be told you the complete truth as to what just happened there and then she asked for that one thing and you're just like I swear that's what happened it's not <laughs> it's not what happened Oh boy. God, this show is so good. This show was so good. Oh my god. Had a little bit had a little bit of tears and a little bit more tears and just a whole lot of no, no, don't do that. Stop it. Oh, son of a gun, man. Wow. It was like seven out of nine episodes had me. Shed tears, think. Which my God, that's a that's a new record. Usually you get like the one episode to where it's just like, man, that's rough. That's real sad. I'm a bit weepy here. This whole show had like six episodes to where it's just like, <laughs> what is that happening? It's just like Boy. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. One of these one of these days, I gotta go through just one of these one of these videos and see how many times I say like because my goodness if that's a word I was thinking about public speaking the other day because of doing all this stuff and I th one of one of the last I think it was episode seven I know I'm going off on a bit of a tangent I'm just kind of talking to you right now but uh I was going through and I was editing that and I was listening to myself, obviously, as one does, as one edits a video. And I said like a lot. And it's in that context to where it's just like, <laughs> exactly, it's like that. You sit there and it's like, and you know, you know what I'm saying? You do all that and it's like, you got like all that crap. And boy, oh boy, if that didn't now, every time I've recorded, well, episode eight and this episode, it's just been, it's been in there. And every time I say it, I'm just conscious about it. I'm like, God damn it. Shut up. Oh boy. That was a little side tangent though. That was just a little, uh, little side piece that just popped in my head there. Anyways, the last of us is done. It is, well, season one is done. We got a whole playlist on the channel now for The Last of Us. Got The Sandman, we got The Last of Us. And I gotta say, it's very satisfying. And to those of you that joined me on this little journey, that continue to join me on these little journeys, man, I appreciate the hell out of you. All the love is appreciated, and I appreciate you. I am Ben Nazu flew off. She's chilling. Roxy is still chilling. Whew. Man, what a ride. What an emotional, just, God, a gut punch of a roller coaster that this show was. Holy moly. All right, that's going to do it, everybody. Again, all the love is appreciated, and I appreciate you. And this is going to be a good old solid. <gasps> Oh my god.